Hi viewers, welcome back. So viewers, this one is my JCB boom loader. So this uh, loader is not starting. So I'm going to check what is the issue to this uh, machine. So viewers, you can see now I am inside the cabin and I'm going to on the machine. Now machine is on. So now we're going to start it. but not cranking so this machine is not cranking I again off on no cranking so here as you can see here is my starter okay so it's a very narrow space but first I check battery voltages my battery voltage is coming here so you can see the battery voltages are coming so you can see the battery voltages are coming I check the voltages here downside which are coming from the key switch to the starter solenoid I will remove the wire from here then I check the voltages when start the machines um, what is coming or not here you can see when we turn the start key switch to the start position side the voltage is coming here so I am going to try give direct supply to the starter maybe my motor is jumped it's a dangerous but I have tried to direct start but this is sparking it mean the self have a problem okay so the surface is stuck so I'm going to open it and check what is the issue to it so here's now I'm going to open this uh, starter the space is very narrow here so therefore I'm going to off the camera and off camera I will remove it and take it out then I will uh, check it in front of you what is the problem to this uh, starter you can see I have removed the harness and also bolt from the starter now I am bringing it out okay after it I will check it so here you can see after removing I brought the starter to my workshop and now I dismantled it and you can see it is too much dirt inside uh, I think maybe water has gone inside therefore this uh, starter was uh, jammed okay so I open it now I will clean it okay. so here is also you can see too much uh, and this uh, dirt inside and here you can see also this is rusting our rotor is rusted okay so therefore this starter was not jammed inside and was machine was not cranking so now I'll clean it and then after it fix it back and I show you its condition
so viewers you can say i have cleaned it so now i am going to fix it back and uh, after fixing it after i check it so it is a now is a better not too much clean but is now is a it will work so we use this trick by fixing our back to the this uh, carbon brushes fixing back when you are working alone so this trick is very excellent don't skip the video from here because this trick is very good uh, because the carbon brushes fixing is very tricky work this one so you have to check how we can fix the carbon brushes back when you are alone working here so you must carefully check it it is very important for you people So views you noticed. So in this way, we can easily uh, fix the, the carbon brushes on the router. Okay. So this trick you must use when you are uh, working on this uh, starter. After fixing these carbon brushes and the router, so in this way we remove the pins okay, and uh, our work will uh, become easy. Hello, so viewers, now it is ready. Okay, my starter is ready. I'm going to test it. I clean it very well. Okay, so after fixing it, now I'm going to. So you can see I fixed the connections. Now I'm going to test it. Okay, so you can see I'm going to test it. I give the these voltages to the starter. So you can see my okay now my starter is working good one so yes now you know can uh, you see i have cleaned this uh, starter now I'm fixing back okay so now I will off my camera here so here you can see I have fixed my starter back okay so now I'm going to start the machine okay okay start So here as you see my problem has finished the problem was a starter so just I clean it so again once first again once again I'm going to start it okay, so now start so you can see now the my computer is my machine is started so everything is okay okay so hope you like this video please don't forget to subscribe my channel and share this video